So Magento 2 is out, and if, like me, uh, you're very used to Magento version 1, uh, what you'll want to know is where some of the items are uh, in the menus. You'll notice when you, when you go into the back of Magento 2 that there has been a bit of a reshuffle with the menu items. The functionality is all pretty much there, the same as Magento 1. Uh, you'll just find them in different places. So the one that um, I kind of, uh, it took me a little while to find um, was transactional email. So it was kind of hiding in plain sight to us, but um, but like many things within Magento, once you know it's there, then it, then it makes your life that much easier. So let's have a look, transaction email. So um, previously transaction emails you found under the system menu, okay, and within the system menu, there was an item in there called transactional email. Okay, that was in Magento version one. Uh, the system menu has been greatly reduced in uh, in Magento version two, so it really does deal with with system tasks. Um, but what we want to uh, look at is actually this menu item here, which is marketing. If I click on that, you'll see that there's this area here, which is to do with communications. Okay. And the reason why I, I was struggling to find transaction emails is because they've changed the label. It's now called email templates okay which um, is fine kind of makes a bit more sense because not all of the emails that are generated by Magento are to do with transactions so if we go into email templates you'll see there we've got the email template grid which is the same pretty much the same as what the transaction email template grid was like and we can just go in and add a new template okay so when we go into add a new template, again, what we're looking at here is actually pretty similar to what we had in Magento version one. We have our template menu here, which are drop down, and that is a list of all of the templates that we can load up to then modify to create our own versions of. What is quite useful in version two, though, is that these have been um, grouped together into emails that kind of make sense to be in those groups. So we have here are all of the emails which are to do with the customer account, we have emails down here, which is to do with all the sales process and so on. So hopefully it should make life easier um, finding the email that you want to edit. And what I'll do as well is, is in the blog post that relates to this uh, this video, I will put a list of those um, those templates in there. So at least there's a central central source of reference. And uh, so there you go. That's um, in it as a recap. If you want to find transaction emails, you go to the marketing tab, and within there you go to email templates.